battling it out in Losers Finals. Charlie awaiting the winner of this in Grands, but it is gonna be game one back to PS2. Familiar battleground for the two of these. Pyros offering to start this without the bomb in hand, just going for a couple of fares. Misses the tech, but rolls back safely, knowing that Muffin was on top of the platform. Thing in fact, gonna be waited out, but he dropped shield at the wrong time. And what a connection with the arrow as well as he was flying towards the platform. Runs straight into that back throw afterwards. Unfortunately, gonna recover high to avoid the PK Thunder too. Applying all the shield pressure with a down air, the boomerang, and the bomb. Batting back the arrow. Gets that as well and goes for the PK freeze. He's just gonna delay back knowing he had the safety of the bomb, but there is no safety from that down smash. Goes above him with an air, but it's not gonna be active enough for him to land with it. Drops him into the up smash too. Goes forward, but that spinning attack through the platform is just so hard to hit, especially when your opponent has missed a tech and you just have such an awkward hitbox to aim for. Or when they do hit the tech and you have the invincibility to, to contend with, but is able to get the arrow to up air. He's gonna juggle a few bombs as he waits for Muffin to descend from the Angel platform. No bomb, but able to use that spinning attack to make it back. Another down tilt into fair. Without a jump, not gonna be risky. Just gonna go for the spinning attack afterwards. Almost had the full range of the PK fire, but Kairos hanging back at a smart distance to the point where his bomb throws will connect. Another down smash off to the drag down. Curls an arrow off in the wrong direction. Another up air. Still living. Neutral air is going to be his safety back. And this time the up air through the platform is going to be the second stock gone for Muffin. Kairos already looking very strong here. Another drag down fair as well, only getting fair one. And I don't think Muffin was at all prepared as he just missed the tech there. Down tilt in the hero spin. Still a ways away from killing at 80% after the hits, but with all this projectile that's been just tackling up this damage. That's gonna be a quick punish though. Muffin from Mars, able to get Kairos down to last stock, but who knows for how much longer he's gonna be able to live at least a little bit more, just barely surviving that. Two bombs at ledge to contend with. And Kairos gonna react first with his Nair. Goes high. And gonna be met with the forward smash as well. Picked the right option. If he had drifted to the right, he could have been met with up smash, but as Muffin opted to go back to the ledge, Kairos picking the right move there. Forward smash is gonna be his ticket to game one. Pyros and Muffin moving on to Smashville. I believe this is the house preview theme. There's the taste. Spinning attack. And once again, he doesn't go for this up air afterwards, which you can do from low percents to get a bit more damage rather than one back air. He wants to extend the back air into something else, perhaps another back air or a fair or even a nair if he has the drift to do it. Through this labyrinth of projectiles, is able to get a fair, but Ops to regain stage control instead of pressing the issue any harder. Rapid Jab's gonna PK freeze, but escapes the ledge in time, drags him up into the up smash. 
Fair one into the down tilt, into the spinning attack. What style from Kairos. If you're going to lose a stock, might as well do it to a combo like that. Is he dead again? No, he fell out. Very close to the ledge there, even at 38%. And the bomb not going to blow up in time. The fuse not saving him there. Down tilt. Misses the tag on top of the platform, but does not choose a roll direction. Very smart. Muffin has to make it back safely around some of these bombs at ledge. And his disadvantaged state hasn't even been that bad in this game. Kairos is just having his way with Muffin in neutral. Drags him into the up smash with Fair One as well. What can't Kairos do at the moment with Fair One? Drops one bomb in the juggle, so going to take a bit more bonus damage, but with the way he's playing it might not even be necessary. Spot dodges around that and able to get a spinning attack. Drops one bomb at ledge this time rather than two to force the roll. Able to get an up air after the grounded spinning attack this time, but he landed right into the F smash. Still alive at 101. Probably would not have killed across the stage. Down tilt into up air. Gonna reverse his momentum with the magnet. Dips through the platform. He's gonna tether back this time instead of going for the spinning attack. And I like the decision before he can even just get any of these projectiles out. He's just gonna air dodge, but he cannot avoid that up air. Kairos with a second game victory. And we are one game away from an all Legend of Zelda Grand Finals. Can't imagine Muffin would switch characters here, but gonna have some, have some sort of switch in game plan. We're just going to jump straight into it, going right with one there. Even with the fair one onto shield, he's able to get the down tilt afterwards. And before that down air can come out. Kairos has managed to amass 83% onto Muffin from Mars before he could even just take any damage. Finally able to get a few percent. But in the grand scheme of things, with the amount that Kairos is basically able to get off of a single interaction, not even able to punish that spinning attack and caught the air dodge down. Up, smash on top of the platform, connecting all three hits as well. Muffin sent skyward, but able to get the back throw on top of the platform. And one hit of Bear is able to lead into the spinning attack too. Rolls around the down tilt. Makes it back, but the bomb put him right into what would have been the F smash and possibly the stock. But drags him down, still a bomb in hand, didn't even need it. Caught by that though, and right after is going to get the up special out of the grounded spinning attack. Goes past the ledge, but just shifts his weight, shifts his direction. Tries to go for a kill off the top of the up air, and not too far away, but Muffin, we saw the sparks there, and just about killing off the side. He did every bit of rage to assist with that one. Boomerang gonna make contact on top of the platform. Down tilt, but the up air not forthcoming. Saw him just going for some of these other kill attempts, but Muffin able to stave off death for now, sitting at 185. That short hop nair is going to kill from across the stage. Mm -hmm. 
What does Muffin have left in the tank here? Spinning attack gonna cover the entire platform, but Muffin gonna retreat. Reset him back into center. PK freeze to occupy the ledge. And air dodges around that, but able to get the F smash afterwards. Got him right where he wanted him. Excellent bait from Muffin. Able to parry though and waits out the spinning attack. Now he's starting to play a bit better. Rapid jab will put him at 68. Text in place, but met with another dash attack or a tilt out of shield. Out of dash, excuse me. Up air, no. Down tilt into the spinning attack. He's very high, but he's gonna live with the proper DI. Tries to get him back off the ledge, but he clips him with the down tilt at ledge and the spinning attack is gonna get that third and final stock on. A clean 3-0 sweep for Kairos and he is going to march his way onto Grands. Charlie to King awaits him.